Hello everyone, I just got back from vlogging and again, I've been busy for a while, for a long month because my job is teaching. And speaking of teaching, my vlog is about teaching here in Japan. And of course, to be a teacher here in Japan, you need to have experience. And to have an experience, you need to explore everything that you can. And exploring things, speaking of which, we went to Australia just for a seminar in UNSW. This seminar is conducted by the one and only Filipino education professor in Australia and his name is Dennis Alonso and please enjoy watching Malaki ang ginagampan ng papel ng mga teacher sa buhay ng mga kabataan lalo na sa kanilang mga formative years kaya naman ito pa sa pagiging dakila ang sinumang may malasakit na magturo katulad na lamang na isang Pilipino dito sa Australia na nararapat lamang ang aan High five. Give a high five. High five. Oh yeah. Bye bye. <laughs> Pangarap talaga noon ni Professor Dennis Alonzo na maging doktor. Nagtapos siya ng BS Biology sa University of Southeastern Philippines sa Davao bilang pre-medical course niya. Ngunit dahil salat sila sa pera noon, hindi na niya ito natuloy. I had kissed all phases of poverty, all kinds of rejection. But yeah, all you need to do is just focus on your goals. Nothing can undermine your goals if you work hard for it. Halos pikit matang nagdesisyon si Professor Dennis noon na lisanin ang Pilipinas. Hindi pa niya kasi alam kung paanong mamuhay sa ibang bansa. Maging sa klima at kultura, hindi pa niya naranasan. Ito ay nang kumatok ang oportunidad sa kanya na mag-aral sa Australia. Dito mas naaalala ni Professor Dennis na ayaw na niyang maging mahirap. At ngayon, handa na siyang maibahagi sa buong mundo ang kanyang mga bagong natuklasan. This is some information, this is, this is some evidence that initiatives designed to enhance effectiveness of the way assessment is used in the classroom to promote and generate pupil achievement. It's not about teaching strategies that really matter, but it's the way teachers use assessment. Si Professor Dennis ang kauna-unahang Pinoy na naging university lecturer sa larangan ng edukasyon sa Australia. Siya rin ngayon ay isang test and scale developer, program evaluator, curriculum designer at applied statistician. Umiikot ang kanyang interes sa assessment for learning kagaya ng pagsuporta sa mga teacher na maging highly contextualized at magkaroon ng fair at trustworthy assessment decisions para sa mas epektibong paggabay sa mga estudyante. Taking a seminar here at UNSW. Uh, the, uh, this uh, kind of seminar. You know, I want to come back here soon. I learned a lot from our seminar. Um, it's actually a good opportunity to grow professionally. For me, it's a big help because uh, it, it creates more on uh, creative thinking. Yeah. Find a working environment that supports you and values you. Never ever work with an insecure boss. You will find constraints in executing your full potential. Also, you need to establish a good relationship with your colleagues, find someone to mentor you in many aspects, and establish and expand your networks, not only in your workplace, but go out and as much as you do international collaborations as well. Here we go.